Let's test this 3x5 element Shaggy for Jonathan Mendoza. This is a dual band vertical Yagi for 2 meters and 70 centimeters. This is now configured. The tuning stub is marked with marking tapes and position in between those tapes. So this is the gamma match and the feed point. Make sure that you tighten the PL25 main connector. Do the same on the UHF side. So this is the UHF gamma match and the tuning stub is marked with marking tapes. Position the tuning stub in between those marking tapes. Make sure that you fully secure the PL259 connector on the feed point. The pacing harness is connected to the T connector. Connected by the feed line, which is an RG8 coaxial cable going to my nano VNA. So let's check the frequency response of this antenna for the center frequency at 145 megahertz. So let me just focus the camera. Now it's clear, we have a clear focus. So at 145 MHz, we have 1.2 SWR, the green color. So this is usable from 142 to 148, but you can extend the use depending on the SWR or from 140 to 150, but the performance will not be the same. Uh, from those bands so this is centered at 145 MHz at 1.21 SWR the green uh, text on the nano VNA and the green marker uh, below so the return loss of, uh, of this antenna is about 20.36 dB at frequency of 145 MHz going. Let's check the bottom frequency which is 142. So let's move the car to 142. So at 142 we have, let me refocus the camera, we have 1.25 1 SWR on 142 and let's check 148 going up. So let's move the car soar. Going up. to 148 MHz or I can just drag this marker and go to 148 so that's 148 megahertz at 1.27 or 1.3 SWR return loss is about the same 18 dB on both 142 and 148 megahertz center is 1. 145 megahertz at 1.2 so this is working good on the VHF side so let's change the frequency settings and read the response on the B UHF side so let's enter the start frequency at 430 megahertz and the stop frequency at 
440 megahertz so this is the frequency response of the antenna at the bottom of the car we have 430 MHz on top of the screen the SWR is 1.8 going to the center let's move the car sir. at the center so that's the bottom of the car let's so at 435.200 we have 1.16 or 1.19 SWR at minus 21 dB return loss so at the end of the curve let's go to 440 that's 435 as we can see on the screen 435 megahertz or 440 megahertz now the upper band is 1.82 or 2 is to 1 SWR from 430 to 440 so the antenna is configured properly and hopefully this uh, will not change as I ship the antenna to Mr. Jonathan Mendoza. This is now ready for shipping and I just need to pack the antenna and send it to him. Thank you for watching and supporting Antenna by Panda.